Hey guys, it's Hamby, and uh, I just got done watching the trailer for Star Wars The Force Awakens. Let's be honest, I just got done watching the trailer about 10 to 15 times. Um, I got a top five things I want to talk about. Uh, please discuss in the comments down below. Like this video if you enjoy it. Uh, you can check out more of these videos, youtube.com slash Hamby Plays Games. But let's get right to it. Number one, we see Rey. Uh, she's kind of a space scavenger, and there's a voiceover. Someone asks her, who are you? She responds, I'm no one. So there's an implication, who is this character? But also, maybe she is important. She just doesn't know it yet. Uh, we see that she's a space scavenger. We see that she ends up on a desert planet. Ships are taking off. She's looking off in the distance. Uh, the second one uh, that I want to talk about, uh, actually, no, the, yeah, the second one I want to talk about is Finn. Uh, the Stormtrooper character, who has a lightsaber at one point. Um, I was raised to do one thing, but I've got nothing to fight for. Uh, and while that's happening, Finn is escaping. What well, it looks like he's escaping in a TIE fighter. He crashes on uh, what looks like the same desert planet that uh, that Daisy Ridley's character, Ray is on. And that's how the two of them meet up. Uh, the third thing I noticed... Um, I don't know if it's Supreme Lord Snoke's character or the other character, Adam Driver's villain, uh, but he does say, nothing will stand in our way, I will finish what you started, uh, and he's saying this to Darth Vader's melted helmet, what? So they're trying to hold on to that dark side, uh, uh, the, uh, the, uh, fourth thing, where am I? Uh, Rey is speaking to Han Solo, and she says, there were stories about what happened. And he responds with, it's true, all of it. And it shows the Millennium Falcon on that cell, the same desert planet, it looks like, uh, is saying uh, being they're being chased by TIE fighters. And you see uh, then they're overlooking like a map. And it's Finn and Rey speaking to Han Solo. So they, they do meet up and it looks like uh, Finn and Rey are on this desert planet, uh, Jakku, maybe? Is that what they called it, Jakku? Um, and then Han Solo ends up there with the Millennium Falcon. It's a movie, things start to come together. Uh, and then, of course, the last thing, um, coming off of, there were stories about what happened, it's true, all of it. Uh, we hear another voiceover from Han Solo. As we're hearing this, it's war. I mean, there is war everywhere. You have guys with red lightsabers cutting people down. You have X-Wings shooting at uh, stormtroopers. You have X-Wings versus TIE fighters. You've got all this stuff going on. Uh, and uh, he says, the dark side, the Jedi, the real. And that's Han Solo. So those were the five things I took away from this trailer. There was a sixth voiceover, but this is, I wanted to do just a top five uh but star wars the force awakens as i'm posting this video we are two months away and tickets are selling out fast this became an event good for you disney good for you lucasfilm i can't wait to see this movie i little story uh my mom took me out of school when i was a kid to go see return of the jedi and she got me return of the jedi luke skywalker and return of the jedi darth vader because there was different luke skywalkers and darth vader for each movie and i sat in the theater and uh Sorry for Return of the Jedi. I won't do that as an adult. Uh, I don't have toys like that anymore, but I'm still excited. Thanks for watching.